Hello, I'm Alan Rake. And I'm Matthew. I say when we first started out, it was we were rehearsing in after work. We all just sort of jumped in the studio. I think usually myself and Matthew would come with a sort of basic idea. We really wanted to play a gig. And so the process of writing at that stage very early on was this impatience sort of coming through, okay, that's two minutes long, that'll do, it's got all the bit of bits in it, it's yeah. got the key change at the end, fine. Yeah. <laughs> you know, it's very much about this energy of the, the four in the group. I guess sort of, you know, look, when you're sort of learning how to work together and learning how to sing you know, your instruments individually, it starts off a bit simple and sort of that's where the sort of punk energy comes from and simple structure and stuff like that. And then, yes, yeah, as, as you sort of develop them, that sort of isn't enough. Sometimes Matt will be like have an idea on guitar and then a sort of cool vocal melody and the basic sort of idea of you know, what the mood of the music is and what the lyrics could be and then yeah, then it's sort of fun because it's passed on to me yeah. and then I can sit at home with a recording of the track and then sort of work it all out and be really anal about it and making sure it rhymes and stuff like that. Say so with World Was A Mess, mm. we had to write this song for um, Dior at first we were like, we didn't know if we'd have time to do it, or um, then he said he'd give us a free tie, so we agreed. <laughs> um, so it's just like two chords, and, and originally I was sort of hum humming... Dun, 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 dun. That was like a couple of lyrics, that, mm. or a couple of basic ideas. Because we were writing it for, you know, a, a, a beautiful fashion house, and sort of um, at the time they were invading Iraq, and um, it was like all this chaos happening, you know, you know, on TV, and it was like absolutely crazy. And then we we're like, well, oh, commissioned to write a, you know, piece of music for like this very lardy da sort of fashion house in Paris, and there. Male catwalk show, and it's such a sort of dichotomy. We're like, oh, you know, a very sort of strange time to be in, and uh, sort of writing a song about the context in which, in which the song would be used for. So it's about a male model who, uh, you know, just sort of cares about his hair, um, but, you know, the rest of the world is sort of going to hell in a Tesco's trolley. <laughs> the amount of time it takes to, <clears throat> you know, playing songs live and writing them properly and getting up to scratch, you know, sorting out drum patterns and all the component parts gives whoever's writing the lyrics um, a lot of time for re-editing and really polishing them up sort of things, getting to a high, um, high spec. I've noticed you have that you notebook out a few times. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. On stage. Yeah. 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 How many people are clapping <laughs> at that point? Okay, tick that verse goes down very well. <laughs>